Well, hello, Kaz. How are you doing? I'm doing well. How are you? I'm doing great. <laughs> so here we are on the Gretz Legacy talking about Patrick, his legacy, how he has influenced your life. And um, my first question for you would be, how did you meet Patrick? I first met Patrick when he was on Wayne's channel and he was doing the talking with the planets. That's how I first knew of him. And I was just blown away by what I was seeing. And because I've never seen anything like that in my life. I've never seen anybody use a pendulum, to be honest. It was the first and time? One, that was the first time, yeah. Wow. And I was just sat there with my mouth open going, <laughs> <laughs> what's going on? Because when I first saw him on the show, I sort of joined it late. So I didn't get what was happening. Okay. And I was just, I was just watching him and this thing moving around. I was just going, what's going on here then? <laughs> and it was crazy. And ever since then, I started to watch his stuff on his channel and join in, ask my questions of my own that I wanted to know about. And then I had a private meeting with him as well to further my questions, what I wanted to know of what was going on in my life too. And yeah, from there really. So you, asked, you, you, you did ask a question in the chat room before I came over. <laughs> yeah, I did. Yeah, before you took the driving seat. Yeah. Were you satisfied by the answer? Yeah, yeah, I was, yeah. Yes. It was just interesting. Well, it was it was just being blown away again by getting an answer from a source yeah. that I didn't know existed. Do you remember yeah. the question? <laughs> um my first question, yeah was drunk to say yeah it was asking is there a huge planet next to earth which takes up our whole sky and is our sky and the reply was yes wow. it is our sky and more than one <laughs> that takes over our sky and is our sky yeah Wow. That, so that blew my head off again, yeah. <laughs> well, I sort of knew that. <laughs> it was just confirmation for me. Do you know what I right, mean? Right. And when when did you start uh, working the pendulum? Um, I started, it was about planet, talking with the planets, about after that number three, I went out and got myself a pendulum and I thought, right, because I've already got a sort of connection with crystals and stones, I thought, I can do this. I bet I'm going to be good at this because <laughs> I feel like I've got a strong connection with them already. And so I went down to the local shop in Mountain Mowbray and got myself a, a pendulum. Well, it chose me actually. It sort of jumped off the shelf. <laughs> <laughs> so it started moving right away when you touched it. Yeah. And the people in the shop were going, I think that one likes you. <laughs> and <I was> going, <laughs> yeah. That's how yeah, it that's usually works, right? That's how yeah. you choose your pendulum. Yeah, and this one was great. <laughs> so do you feel you have a connection with the planet in particular um i would say it has to be a frequency 
Um, I speak to her a lot. Even before I knew about a pendulum, I speak, I was always speaking with her. She's been like my, I call her my rock. <laughs> I could have said that, my rock. <laughs> She's my rock. Um, yeah, it'd be a frequency for sure. And did you did you talk to her with the pendulum? I haven't yet. No, not yet. Okay. No, as far um, I'm still trying to contain the energy because sometimes I feel like I'm going to go pop because I get really sort of overexcited. And I'm just focusing on one thing at the minute until I get more relaxed with it because um, I just need to calm down a bit, you know. It's all getting a bit, I get a bit too excited. And um, once I learn to focus my energy okay. and not get too overwhelmed, I'll be able to chat to the planets a lot easier. So who without. else have you talked to? with your pendulum? I speak to my stones. You do? Okay. I don't speak to my stones, yeah, because, um, well, I felt like I'd take them out of their reality and prison that into my room. And I didn't want them to feel like that, so I asked them how they were, and they're absolutely fine. Yeah, they're absolutely fine. <laughs> And they're happy to be here with me. And they like being here with me, which is good. But, you know, it's important to me that they were happy and that I hadn't kidnapped them mm -hmm. from their territory and put them in a dish next to my bed, you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> but now they're happy to be here. <laughs> right. <laughs> and they, do, they like to be called stones. And... As you know, we, we spoke to one and found out his name. One of my favourites. What is it's it? called Oro. Oh. You want to see? Oro. Um, yeah, show it. Oh. Put down a minute. This one. Hello, Oro. You're going to be famous. What is this? Yeah. This is Oro. He's beautiful, look. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. It looks like a dinosaur. Uh, he does. <laughs> He's gorgeous. Hello. Yeah. How are you doing? I don't think his voice is really like that, but you know. But he's got a different face the other side. Yeah. More serious face. But he's beautiful. Yes, you can see. it looked like it's two rocks stuck together. Well, isn't it? Yeah. But that was my first bit of petrified tree stump I found. And it is so nice to hold in your hand. It just fits. <laughs> right. Oh, strange. So yeah. you got picture for us today? Right. Hey. You got some picture for okay. us today? I do have some picture, yeah, hang on. Put that in there. Right, share my screen. Okay. I have. Can you see that? Yes. Okay. Patrick, my friend, these are for you. It took me a long time to seek 20 out of about 57,000, <laughs> but I managed to narrow it down for you. Okay. Right, I'm just going to go into full screen. Okay. Um, okay. Right. Now, this one here, just looking at it, I mean, some people might be able to see see the dragon. Yes. But um, as you move along, 
that's just in a different color but when you invert the color on it which is this yes you see what is that do you see that yeah do you see the dragon yeah oh yes you see yeah. The yeah. and the wings are really well spread out yeah Beautiful, and that's a foot. Mm. So, which um, one would that be? That would say this, this one is Firebird. That's her. Well, nice to that's meet her. you, Firebird. She's Firebird, everybody. Mm -hmm. Um, is she beautiful? Yeah, so her colors that's her. In normal and that's sort of normal but with a slightly different filter and then that's her uh, inverted because that's the clearest I could get her and that picture was taken two years ago right yeah this was taken on the 23rd of April the day we were originally meant to do the show right in 2017. yeah so, so last week it was we were supposed to do the show but then we had technical problem and 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 then yeah. but it would last week it would have been two years day for day that you taken that picture oh, yeah yeah that was quite an amazing time match if you like. i hope you and like then, that patrick oh, yeah look. patrick firebird yeah, this is Firebird. Oh, yes. And Not Firebird on the side. Here. But taken I from mean, a different I... angle. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. This bit zoomed in a bit too much, that one. But there you go. She's gorgeous, isn't she? Yeah. Oh, too many. <laughs> there we go. And that one's sort of got a wing out to the side. And the other wing's obviously not in the picture. But could you see how our horns go back? Yeah. There. And she's got a long sort of nose and a neck. She's gorgeous, isn't she? Yes. And those are Kim trailing. This here. Yeah. That's chemtrails, yeah. All right. Um, yeah, down there and under them. But she was right. That obviously, that's the sun. Yes. So she was sort of. You wouldn't be able to see her on a normal picture because of the sun would be too bright. So that's right. Yeah. Now this next one, which you. <laughs> no, it's not a real dragon, it is an ornament, but you never guess what I I had uh, I found in my pictures, but I want you to concentrate on the face, right? Right. So when you look at this face, yeah. Um, it does look like how what, what, they've what? got the spiky heads. Yeah. You could be real. Like, it could be real. It could be pretending to be an ornament. You don't know, do you? No. <laughs> in this next photo, what you're going to see in the cloud is just the head part, right? Right. So, let me just... Oh, what? Oh, okay. Okay, so in this cloud here, do you see his head? It's there. Yeah. Do you see? Do you see him here? Yes. It's like you, you, you see the face, like facing, right? Yeah, there's his eye. That's the top of the head, and it sort of just comes around here, like that. 
Can you see? Yes, incredible picture. Okay. I didn't see <laughs> that one last I'm time. I you could see it. And it's... No, this is a new one. Yeah. This is one of the new ones I told you about. Okay. Yeah. So when you look at the face, uh, let me just zoom out here. But this one, you can see it's on the sort of sideways view here. Right. Yeah. It's got the same spiky head. Yeah. And it's got like an eyebrow going over the eye. Do you see? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yes, I see it. It is clear to it me. Looks like it looks like a baby dragon. Right. It could be. <laughs> Could be five birds, baby. Right, okay. And then, what do we have? Now, this picture. Oh, look at that. This picture was took. It's amazing. To November 2016. Yeah. When I first started taking pictures of the sky. And it was like, you see the face there. Mm. It was like these funnels coming down. Yeah. It, it was crazy. And I got the whole sunset from the start to the end. I think there was over 600 pictures <laughs> of this one sunset. <laughs> All right. It was so amazing. Well, yeah. it's a pretty sunset. <coughs> yeah. But yeah, what amazes me, in. what amazes me is just on top of the sun, a bit on the right, there's like cloud that goes. They go like they make X, right? They're probably right caused there. by a uh, chem trail right there, right there. Yeah. Yeah. You see a multiple of X everywhere. Yeah, yeah, and then you've got the ones up here. Yeah, that looked like an angel. It looked like a phoenix. Yeah. It does, doesn't it? Yeah. The phoenix. With it the does. tail in the back. Yeah, here. And the wings are up and its head. Yeah. Here. Oh, yeah. yeah. Wow. <laughs> wow. Yes, it's pretty. And this was, uh, I've not done anything to this picture. This is how it looked. Yeah. The same night. Um, the same night. The so same you, night. Just, you, you didn't change the color on those pictures, did you? I didn't change the color. I didn't touch it, no. The same so night. Was, Isn't well, that something? Look at those color. I know. It's Unbelievable. Just, never seen a sunset like this one it was just amazing and these you see how it goes into a like a point like a spinning top yeah they were coming in all over the hills it was like rolling in over the hills yeah but there were loads of these loads of these little spinning top things okay and it was just amazing yeah. and Right at the end. Look at that. This is how it ended with it. And it was just, wow. <laughs> yeah. It just, right. Crazy. So how long this sunset lasted? This, I would say, it was in November, so it was quite short. Uh, probably from start to finish. About three quarters of an hour. Forty-five minutes. Maybe. Eh? Hey. Uh, Forty-five. Yeah, maybe about half an hour max. I'd say that time of year. Wow. So I was just tapping away to get. It was just amazing. It was just the colours. Yeah. Yeah, it sure is. Yeah. Now this one, 
This one was very strange. It had like a rainbow. Yeah, it's a see. rainbow in the cloud. And we the didn't cloud. used to have rainbow in the cloud before. No. And it's not even an arc, is it? It's going this way. It has a little bit of a curve in it, but... It, it have a little bit, yeah. But it's not what it should be. This way. <laughs> yeah. Like we normally do. Yeah. That was crazy. This cloud is an odd one. Very yeah, very. Look. Now this. Yeah. This happened two days after the Great Heaven. So as September the twenty third, two days later, this. But look how it's wrapped. Yeah. Wrapped around. The sun had already set, by the way, on this. It, it looked the like the clouds are behind the sun. It does, doesn't it? Because you look here, it's actually pushing through. Yeah. Yeah. Crazy or what? Yeah, it is. You can see it's wrapped around it. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah, that was two days after the great sign in heaven. And this was all pink dust over the countryside. Pink dust. And the dust. sun has got all the sun down. Okay. The soil dust, was yeah. covered? The sun had already gone down here. Okay. And then this came out. Really? Yeah. And so, I managed to stop and get this. And this was all pink dust. Wow. Everywhere. Yeah. So that was quite a mad photo. I've never <laughs> seen like, pink dust. I do not. We get it a lot here in England all the time. Really thick. Really? Pink? Really. Um, um, it's not so bad at the minute, but a couple of weeks ago, it was every single day, every single night. At night, you, could, you couldn't see your hand in front of your face from the pink dust. Okay. It was really thick. All right. Late at night, yeah. All right. And then we have the orbs above my house. Those are huge. Oh, no. <laughs> They're massive, aren't they? This is taking off the night vision. A still shot taken from the night vision device I use at night. And, yeah, these were just flying this way across across the screen. I'm <laughs> comparing the orb with the top of the roof and it's yeah. almost the same size. It is, isn't it? Yeah. It's his. Wow. That's one big mother of an orb. <laughs> yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Yeah. And what else? What else? What else? What's the next picture? This oh. one. Is that the one of your crystal? My, my crystal, yeah. That is also here on the board. Do you see? Do you see him? Yeah. Quite clear. The eyes here. Nose. Is that one it's has a name? Similar. Smokey. Mickey? Smokey, yeah. Either, I'll just call him Smokey because he's Smokey Quartz. Um, yeah. <laughs> and look, uh, I think a few people have already seen this one on from probably Wayne's show. Okay. But it is one of my favourites. This was taken in right. November 2016 as well. The window in the sky 
and as you can see it's a perfect window yeah perfect corners yeah right angles and this was just traveling along the tops of the houses wow while well, i went out cigarette one night as you do and this is what you see <laughs> Well, that's Closing why you woke up. up. Yeah, well, yeah, I just nipped out for a cigarette and that was happening. You no could, other. You could feel it. In the sky. No moon, no nothing, just that. <laughs> <laughs> Crazy. And this is a very strange. Um, call it a cloud <laughs> but do you see that it's got big eyes sort of half shut and then this big sort of mouth with the red lips do you see yeah and a sort of upside down mouth well this was hanging outside my bedroom window one day after work and I'd seen it following me around at work when I was driving around in the van. Is that right? home, a cloud following you? There. <laughs> hey. Wow. This thing was huge. It's like I had a photo and there were some birds sort of flying in front of it and they were like tiny little dots. Yeah. But yeah, this was just down in front of my bedroom window. I mean, it, I suppose each to their own. It, it's quite a different looking cloud, isn't it? Yeah, actually, um, I've the thing is, is that I find weird nowadays is the color of the cloud. They used to be white yeah. or some tone of gray. But I've yeah. never seen a cloud blue or pink before today. Well, before, you know, over these days. It. I see all yeah. kinds of cloud of, over here. And I've seen the square in the cloud as a whole, like you, you showed earlier. But never yeah. had any um, uh, proper... Uh, Device to take a picture. The colors are crazy, aren't they? Yeah. Yeah. That looked like another dragon. It does, yeah. This was from a lot. Uh, I think it was 2015. Yeah. This just seemed like something crazy was flying in the sky. And yeah, it was just quite a, a really pretty colors you can see. The pink, yeah, and the that's like a greeny color. Yeah, yeah. it looks like there is green. Yeah, it's green and a pink. Yeah, it's quite quite a crazy photo. Yeah, and I thought Patrick would like these because he did like them when um yeah we did our meeting together. This is what they draw on my blanket. This is one of the art art pieces are called the martian art <laughs> <laughs> and this looking at it now it's got that dragon feel to it yeah it has got that dragony feel to it with the I well you know, can just, you know, definitely when... make an eye of it we can see an eye, eye for eye. sure yeah and then it's got like a It's like they've merged into each other, though. They do tend to merge when they show themselves in the blanket. The faces merge together, and they're constantly changing all the time. Um, but I thought I think I know Patrick would like that one. Mm -hmm. He did say like that one. And then there's ones that look more furry, like animals. And when I did my meeting with Patrick, I was told that I had 
animal spirit guides. Yeah. And that these will show themselves through in the stones and on my blanket and stuff. And you can see this has got more of a furry feel to it. Okay. In the last picture. It's more of a fluffy fairy feel. Okay. And they, these animals, these blend into each other as well. Yeah. They merge into each other. It's sort of like a bird up here with. Yeah. Some I can one. see a, a rule for a dog face and yeah. the hopper right corner. This one? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I can. And I think that them. one is the easiest one to spot. Yeah. These, these at the top are the easiest yeah. to spot. Yeah. <coughs> but yeah, they're, they're animal spirit guides. And I do see in the stones all the time, the main ones are the owl and actually the snake. But I do see a lot of animals in the stones, a lot. Each time, every time I turn them at an angle, I see an animal in it really clearly. So, and then there's old goatee beard. What's that? <laughs> he shows up on my... You see, he's got. Do you see him? Um, His sure. mouth. What is he's it? He's got a white goatee. Oh. Who's I? Yeah. What is it? That's on my pocket. That's it, what? I call it the pirate. Hey. Eh? The pirate? <laughs> the pirate, yeah. It looked like it. With, with a beard? <laughs> with the beard, yeah, with the white beard. And it, that is his smile. That's He's just got a dirty smile. He's crying. <laughs> He's crying. <laughs> He is trying, he did say he tries. But some of them look like they're snarling at you, but they're not, they're smiling. You right. can't remember they're, they're not there's nothing nasty about them. Just like in men in black. Smile, yeah. <laughs> so he's another guy that comes to I see him in the clouds a lot as well. All right. Often. Yeah. Did you put that? Well, apart from the video, yeah, this is a picture I took for Patrick. This is where my pendulum happily sits in his stone, in his little stone with a hole in, with wow. Oro and the others. And I um, see you got a feather. I got a few feathers, yeah, and a few, yeah, just a few bits. And up here is a massive picture of some owls that yeah. look down over the board. So, so yeah, um, there was just one video you wanted to see, wasn't there? Yeah, the, the, the video. Okay, let's get out of here. It's down here. Okay. Yeah. Snow orbs. Yes. There we go. It's this one. Let's give full screen. Okay. Yeah, look at those orbs. Isn't that something? I don't know. They're amazing, aren't they? This is on my blanket, on my bed. <laughs> They shoot out. See that? I think it's so sad to show you anyway. So, yeah. Um, wow. See that just comes shooting out of there then. It makes a difference when you slow it down. Yeah. Those aren't bugs. They're not dust. <laughs> this one's amazing. It's really shiny. And it goes and disappears into my pillow. It's mm. very sad, man. Like they're everywhere. Yeah. Look at that. Back and forth. I know. It's amazing. It's like they're quite hard to film when they go that fast. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know where they're going to go. 
Uh, and that's that one. That's all of them. <laughs> well, thank you. So you got a surprise for uh, Patrick today, don't you? I do. Yeah. Um, let me come out here. Um, I need to see you. Hang on. All right. Um, Oops. Okay. I'm here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so you get a surprise for Patrick today. Yeah, I've got what? a surprise for Patrick. Hopefully, it will behave itself and <laughs> see what it's going to do. We, we <laughs> never know with frequency. So you want to work your pendulum today? I'm going to work my pendulum, yeah. All right. On your show, Patrick, especially Let, for you. Let's do this. <laughs> right, I've got to move this up here one sec, okay? Yeah. There's the owls. Hello. So, down here. Hello. Hello. <laughs> right. So, um, did, did you do your protection before? I did mine earlier, yeah. Okay. Um, that, you can see that, can't you? Yes, we see. So I just need to do my calibration. Yeah? Yes. Hello, this is Cass Hawk. Can you spell my... Oh, no, first of all, do I have a connection with source, please? Yes, thank you. Okay. Right. Can you spell my first short name, please? Thank you. See? A. That's great, thank you very much. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Gets ever so excited. <laughs> right. Okay. Do you have a question? Sure. Can we speak with the dragon firebird, please? Yes. Well, thank you, Firebird. Thank you very much. Remember me, yeah? Okay. <laughs> Looks like Firebird yeah. missed me. <laughs> okay, Firebird, I got a question for you. Is it true that dragon breed fire? Yeah. 
Yes. Yes. It's a strong yes. Okay. So I can get my, my butt fired up. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, Firebird, we know the existence of a blue dragon. Can you tell us the name of the dragon, please? Hey. 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 Tupa. 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 Thank you, Father. Yes. <laughs> Hi, Tupa. Thank you. That's Tupa. Okay. So I would have a question for Tupa. Okay. Question so. Is it okay to speak with Tupa, the blue dragon? Yes. Thank you. Yeah. So, okay. tu Tupa. I would like to know, are you a dragon of water? No. No. That's it. What it says? No. It says no? No. no. Okay. Yeah. All right. Do you have a question for Tupa? Um. I'd like to ask, um, are the dragons all one family. Yeah. Well, I yes. Think it's a general. Yeah, yeah, in general, they are one family, I believe. Yeah. Are you all one family? Yes. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. Okay, I got another question. Yeah. Tupa, are you considered a young dragon or are you considered an old dragon?
I. Um. Considered fairly Young. Dragon. Finish. Wow. Young. Thank you very much. Okay, so we know time for them and time for us is not the same, so I'm not going to ask the age. Yeah. So, can you tell us something about the blue collar that you are? What the blue collar mean? I don't know what happened there. It just well, maybe did, uh, some, sometime we ask question we shouldn't. <laughs> yeah, maybe it's personal. It's yeah. like asking me why do I have pink chick? <laughs> All right. <laughs> no, nah, I didn't want to answer that one. So, <laughs> do you have a question? Um, I can't think. All right, Tupa, I have a question for you. Have you Tupa. last summer? I've seen a strange formation of cloud that looked like just like the queen in the movie of. Independence Day 2. So I want to know was this a dragon or was it something else? This. was dragon
Excuse me. It was a dragon. It was a dragon. Okay, that's comforting. I prefer to see a dragon than the the queen you know, of Independence Day. She wasn't nice <laughs> in the movie. <laughs> Okay. Cool. Okay. All right. All right. Yeah. Do, you, do you have a question? Me? Yeah. Um I would like to ask. I'd like to ask the stones. Okay. If they like their new setup here with the pendulum chart. Okay. Yeah. All right. Okay. Hello, stones. Do you like it here? Do you like the new setup here with the pendulum chart? Wow, look at that. Yes. <laughs> yeah. That's a very strong yes. It is off Thank the you. chart. It is off the chart. Thank you, Stones. Much love to you. Thank you lot. Okay. <laughs> it won't wow. come down. I would have a question <laughs> for you, Stone. Go on then. <clears throat> Hello, beautiful stone. I would like to know, is there any of you that produce some of those orbs that Kaz is uh, photographing? No. No, it's not them. Okay. No, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Would you have one more question? Yeah, go for it. Me? Yeah. All right. Oh, you? Do you have one? Do you have one? Um, not really. <laughs> no, right, you know your rocks better let, than me. Let me see. I was going to ask the dragons. All right. A uh, question for the for the dragons. Are the dragons are you always watching us? I so say yes. Yes. Quite a strong off the chart, yes. Yeah. <laughs> That's nice to know. Thank you. Okay. okay. Would you like to ask the dragons anything? It looks like it wants to say something. Okay. Would you like to say something?
Is that a we. no? A we? No, I think it's a we. We? Yeah. Uh. Always. Watching. Has. Finish. <laughs> well, thank you very much, dragons and rocks. That was something. Yeah. yeah. Bring your computer back. <laughs> yeah. Hello. Well, Patrick's going to be very happy to see that. No, that's what yeah. I call a legacy. So this is how Patrick has influenced you. Don't try to put me this asleep. <laughs> so I'm focusing now. My and I've I've always done sky videos on my channel. I feel like there's enough up there for people to get enough knowledge from. There's three hundred and fifty odd. And I feel now that I need to go this way. And my, it's where my heart is, to be honest. It's where my heart's taking me. Yeah. So, so how, how, <laughs> often, how often do you how practice often? your uh, pendulum? Um, every other day. It comes everywhere with me. It's always here and it sleeps with me. It comes to work with me. When it's not with me, it's in the stones. While I'm eating dinner and stuff, it chills out with the stones. But any other time it's with me and it comes everywhere with me. So I'm always talking to it. And so it is at work with me constantly, really, because it's with me. Well, that's Not, why it's got so much energy. Yeah. Keep on spinning. <laughs> I can just hold it and it, it'll, I can ask it stuff without the chart. And it, it goes mad, yeah. So, uh, yeah, so, I, don't, I don't always use this chart. So you want to do it's, it more? Do you want to I'd apply like to, to replace uh, Patrick on his channel? <laughs> I would never want to replace him ever. He has he had a I replacement, but I fired him right away. <laughs> <laughs> it was nice to do a show maybe one time with him. Well, that that, that new him. Patrick wasn't doing a, good, a great job. I didn't like his reading. <laughs> Yeah, good. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. Be nice, be nice to continue the what yeah. we started. Yes, so. yes. Well, this is what I'm doing right I, now. I, is I I bring all uh, fans of Patrick. I bring them all on uh, the channel, having a chat one on one, showing your ability that uh, because Patrick has showed up on YouTube and end up on Wayne's show and then you saw him uh, uh, doing the pendulum, then you started doing yours. This is what we are trying to say to everybody. You should get yourself a pendulum. You can uh, send me an email. Go in the about section, you're going to see the email, and I will gladly send you a chart from Patrick 
and you can get yourself a pendulum. There's also a video on the Gratz Legacy where Patrick is showing you how to work your pendulum, start from nothing and start with making, well, I'm going to put it in the description box. There is a, a video especially where Patrick is telling you how to get your pendulum going. Also, never forget to do your protection before. And uh, that's it. Anything else to say? That's it. And stick at it. Practice, practice, practice. It's Patrick told me to do. And the results, as you can see, they come out. It happens. Proof in the pudding. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, little apprentice, Patrick. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. Well, yeah. Okay, so <laughs> that's it for today. So I hope you enjoyed uh, the first uh, uh, Gratz Legacy reflection about how Patrick has influenced your life. And this is how Patrick has influenced Kaz alive. And thank you for sharing with us, Kaz. And I hope that Patrick's going to enjoy too. Bye bye, YouTube. Bye, bye Patrick. Bye, bye Patrick. Love you.